Yo guys, Lazy Jamie here, and today we're checking out a video called 20 Shocking Facts about BTS Jungkook You Never Knew Before. How mysterious and drawing. I really want to watch this video now because they're shocking facts and they're gonna shock me. Okay, I don't know what I'm talking about. I thought this would be an interesting video. It's not that long, but a lot of facts to discuss, so there will be some pausing involved. Yes, and also. I don't know if the music's copyrighted or not, so I'm going to be playing the me music and my favourite music to use. <laughs> anyway, yeah, this should be interesting because, <clears throat> like I've said before, as much as I love BTS, I don't know everything about them. And I think that's okay, I don't think you need to know everything about something to be a true fan of it. Like, uh, in the past, I've seen people have a go at people for not knowing BTS very well, so they're a fake fan. but. You know, you don't have to be fully devoted to something to be a fan of it, right? So I really enjoy, you know, watching BTS, listening to the music, of course, but I enjoy watching videos of them even more than I like their music because they just, them as characters, characters, I mean, like, their personality and just who they are, you know, I find really interesting. Like, they're just funny, they're just really funny to look, you know, look at, <laughs> to watch and get involved with. I'm so glad there's so many videos of them around. Anyway, yeah, let's get into this. Um, facts. I don't know, I really don't know what to expect from this, I guess I guess because I've never known them before, but I'm sure there'll definitely be one that some of you already know, maybe even I need. But yeah, let's have a look at this. Uh, 20 shocking facts about Jungkook, Jungkookie, our boy, our boy Jungkook, let's have a look, am I right? Before we get into it, if you enjoy, make sure you subscribe to join the lazy crew today, let's go. Okay, YouTube her jams. You got no jams. <laughs> you got no jams. Okay, 20 shocking facts about BTS members you may never know before. May never have knew, known before, may never knew. So there must be other other episodes of this, but we've only seen, well, I've, I'm only seeing this one now. That's a good fact. That's a good fact. <laughs> that face, that face. Yo, uh -huh. am I right? <laughs> am I right? Well, he can, he can, okay, now it's time. I was, I was thinking like, are those supposed to be the facts or, okay. Also, by the way, there is no sound to this. It's, well, there's just music, so. Jungkook, brackets, cookie, you may never knew before. Maybe not, probably not, let's have a look. Whoa, you just turned into fire, okay. Fire. What? Okay. There he is. Fact number one. Here we go. All members said... Okay, I get the feeling the person who made this isn't... You know, English isn't their first language. I'm just guessing from the way this type of stuff. So, yeah. All members said, John Cook is a member of Bangtan who seems like he'd have a girlfriend older than him, and he admitted it. Is that shocking? He's... He seems like he's had a girlfriend older than him, and that's what he thinks. Is that? I know, I feel like usually, usually, you know, stereotypically in relationships, the man is older, but I think it's okay to have a girlfriend older, it doesn't really make a difference. Unless he means, like, really old. Like, I don't know. I just want to say, like, grey hair, but then again, some of the members have grey hair sometimes, so <laughs> they dye their hair a lot. In ten years, he wants to be an owner of a duck meat restaurants or a tattoo artist. <laughs> At first I thought it just said, he wants to be an owner of a duck. <laughs> like, can't he just get one now? <laughs> Imagine that. Imagine that. He's like, they're doing their performances and John Cook brings a duck on to dance as well. <laughs> we can't leave him in the back. He needs to dance with us. Oh, John, John Duck. John Cook's mum gave 5,000. Uh, what currency is that? I'm guessing that's Korean currency. I don't know what the Korean currency is called. South Korean. Um, to a fan so she could buy a shopper and a bag. She then said, Thank you for loving John Cook. Oh, I'm sure his mum has a lot of money. Oh, wait, hang on. Is that his mum? Oh, it is. I, th I thought at first it might have been Sugar um, <laughs> Yoongi when he was dressed as a woman because he had the same hairstyle as that when he was dressed as the schoolgirl. <laughs> My bad. <clears throat> Fact number four, here we go. Is that his girl? Okay, 
What's this? When asked about their favourite letter, Jim says M and T, uh, Hosuk says S and L, or J-Hope, Yoongi says H and W, Namjoon says J and K, JK, Taehyung says D and A, DNA. Meanwhile, Jungkook says I and U. What? <laughs> what does that mean? What's the relevance of the picture? Because I thought at first he was being cheeky, like I and you, like me and you, you know, we're in love. But is it something to do with the girl? I'm sorry, I feel really out of the loop now and I look so silly for not knowing what's going on. Please explain. <laughs> I'm so thankful because, I, you know, thanks a lot because people always <clears throat> understand when I don't know something and they just explain it in the comments. And, you know, thank you very much. I always thank you in the comments. You know, I always see the top comments are like, um, this is what happened in the video that you didn't understand as usual. But yeah, I'm sorry. I'm a bit out of the loop sometimes, but I'm still learning. Um, I knew. I don't know who that woman is. I'm sorry. Is that his girlfriend? Is she older than him? Or was it his girlfriend? Or is it just pictures of random people? Who knows? <laughs> I like his ears though. The way that's like... Jungkook, ultimate Big Bang fanboy. Bias is G-Dragon. Jungkook's role model is a G... Is G oh, age. It's G-Dragon. Oh! From Big Bang. I know G-Dragon. I know who that is. I mean, I haven't really listened to Bang Big Bang before, but... I recognise the name. I know that. That's cool though. His role model is from another K-pop group. Well, I guess it makes sense. But after dancing in the US, John Cook told Jimin that he wanted to give up BTS and just dance. But Jimin convinced him to stay. Jimin, Jimin is such a—it's like the mother of the group. I swear, he just looks after everyone. That's Jimin's secret role in BTS. Oh, I love that video. <laughs> Jimin's just so nice. I feel like he really motivates them all. And Namjoon. I mean, they all work together ultimately and support each other, but I feel like Jimin and Namjoon are the ones that sort of look after the boys the most. Jungkook said that the colour of underwear women should wear is black. Should wear all, all subjective youths. Maybe he just thinks that's the most attractive. That's interesting thing. I mean, is that a shocking fact? <laughs> In fact, is that a shocking fact? I mean, mm. Jungkook was asked if he already has a name for his future son during the fan sign. He answered, he wants Jon San because it sounds so cute. He says future son, but could be a daughter? Or is that another one of those Korean things where they say son and it could be a son or a daughter? Who knows? <clears throat> Jon San. That sounds nice. It sounds cute. It does sound cute. Nice. I rate that name. Not so shocking though. Not, these aren't really that shocking. I don't think. <laughs> Junko thinks he's not good at acting in front of the camera. Okay, that is kind of shocking because he is good at acting. And also the him wanting to quit was actually quite shocking as well because, you know, he's one of the most beloved, well, I mean, they're all beloved, but, you know, members. I think he's good at acting. When, oh, God. Jungkook has a habit of kissing the camera every time he sees one. <laughs> That's not shocking. I knew that fact. I knew that one. Anyone who's seen one video of Jungkook could have known that. If Jungkook had one hour to make Taehyung happy, he would show him a funny performance that would make him laugh within 20 seconds. <laughs> How was that a fact? Is that something that's already happened or is that what he said he would do? <laughs> I don't, I can't, I'm not sure about that one, but I love that. Him and Tae Young are like really close, aren't they? I, I, ju I literally just watched a V Cook video, you know, Tae Cook, which is like their shit. They're just so fun together, I really like it. Ah, uh, the boys. They're so cute together. John Cook went to the Mnet for, what's the Mnet? I'm not sure what that is. For Superstar K2 auditions and got casted by current company's star. When he danced, Bang Si Hyuk PD told him, no emotion, no emotion while dancing. So he went to the USA for dance training. Damn! But maybe he did just improve a lot. You can't just slate Bang Si Hyuk for saying that, because maybe he wasn't so good back then, and then he improved, so. 
That is surprising though. I thought he would just be like naturally good. I'm not saying he wasn't good. I'm sure he was good, but that's quite harsh criticism. No emotion. Whereas he, I'm sure he was passionate about it. That's, a, that's sad. That's a shame. John Cook is a black belter of Taekwondo. Boy. Hello, do not miss it. Do not mess with this boy. He knows what's up. Boy. <laughs> John Cook doesn't like flat chested girls while V likes them. Damn. Does that mean he's completely ruled them out, even if he sees the most attractive girl, who he thinks to be is the most attractive girl in the world, if she has a flat chest, he's like, nah. That's a bit. I mean I'm not gonna judge him for it, you can't change your personal preferences, but like in what when did in what context, like when did he say this though? It's like is it was he asked in an interview, like they asked all the members and V it's funny how they say while V likes them. Why just V? Do they not ask the other members? Or personally, it doesn't matter for me. But John Cook said when he was younger, he wanted to become a badminton player. Yo, I like badminton. I want to verse John Cook at badminton. I was pretty good back in the day. And when I say back in the day, I mean like three years ago at school, but <laughs> secondary school or high school. But I don't really play anymore. I want to play it again soon though. I like badminton. And what a change of a career he ended up. He thinks Sailor Moon is sexy. <laughs> yes. Yes, Junkirk. Sailor Moon. <laughs> really? I mean, I don't really watch. I never really watched it, but. If Junkirk had to choose a foreign ideal type, he would choose Emma Watson. Really? <clears throat> I have nothing against Emma Watson. I'm not sure she's ugly or anything. I'm not. Definitely not. But I'm just saying. I don't know. I don't get the hype of Emma Watson when it comes to how attractive she is. I don't really think she is that much. And that's not criticism or dissing, I just don't think, I don't know, I feel like she's a bit overrated, you know, that's just my opinion. <laughs> no offense to any more Emma Watson fans, there's nothing personal. When John Cook is nervous, he has a habit of touching his hair a lot. Everyone, when he's on a live broadcast and he's touching his hair, please think, ah, he's nervous. Oh, I get it, so like, yeah, if he touches his hair <clears throat> and a live broadcast, and his, his, you know, his comrades, <laughs> his comrades, his, um, <clears throat> his, uh, what's the, what, what's the word, just, his, you know, his other members of the BTS, and the people watching, if he's touching his hair, that's, a, that's like, yeah. But I mean, I'm sure he, he cares about how his hair looks a lot, so, especially on a live broadcast, you can see yourself. I'm sure they all touch their hair a lot. Especially Jin. <laughs> he cares. Speaking of Jin, there is. John Cook once said that he wanted to drink alcohol, but Jin said no because even though he is an officially an official adult, which means he can, now he is still the golden maknae of BTS and he will still drink milk. Really? Is that like a general tradition of like K pop groups or is that Jin's rules? What does golden maknae mean? Is it just like because he's the youngest? of the group, because, yeah, but why golden? <laughs> like, what? He's a golden boy, he's a shiny boy, <laughs> shiny baby boy. He would still drink milk, I love that. I like milk a lot, I've been drinking it a lot recently, but I've also been drinking alcohol a lot. Uh, yeah, well, not so much in the last few weeks, but, oh, I've wrapped more with his ears, I love that. Things he, that he wants to steal from other members is Rat Monster's knowledge, that's fair enough, Matt wants to... Someone said that he actually has the highest IQ and then V second, because it's on the V Genius video, that's all. Sugar's diverse knowledge. But V has quite diverse knowledge as well. J-Hope's positive mind, yep, of course. Jimin's persistence uh, and his efforts, yep. Jimin is very persistent. V's natural talent, of course. And Jin's wide shoulders. <laughs> all of their best attributes, of course. Oh, I love that pic as well. That's a nice picture, all of them there just enjoying themselves. Yo! The boys! I love BTS! <laughs> well, that was 20 shocking facts that you never knew before. I'm sure you knew some of them, but yeah, that was... Apparently you didn't. Uh, yeah. <laughs> it should be called that you may not have known, or just facts. But yeah, I really enjoyed that. It was nice seeing those, you know. It was really interesting, and some of them, they weren't so shocking. Some of them... I don't know if you would consider fact. I mean, yeah. 
but they weren't very significant. Like the one of him talking about flat chested girls or something, and it's like, okay, but it's not really a shocking fact. Maybe people would find it shocking that he said that because it's something that you don't really say, but I don't, it'd be interesting to know where, when he said that and what context it was in and like situation. Like, did someone ask him? Because if they know what V prefers as well, then I'd assume they must have been talking about her one to, well, at one point, just those two. But, you know, maybe it's just, I don't know, that's interesting. But yeah, there was a really interesting fact in that, I enjoyed that. And if there were more of these, which I'm pretty sure there must be, because at first it said BTS, not a specific member. So, thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed, leave a thumbs up, I enjoyed it a lot. But, um, leave a comment suggesting what I could look at next. Anything else you want, I will check it out. And yeah, subscribe to join the lazy crew today. Cheers.